it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 21st, okay? Uh, somebody asked what deck this was in one of my monthly readings, and I didn't get a chance to respond to it, and the comment is now lost in comment land. And I, I honestly don't have time to go through them all. So for all of you guys that comment, I read every single comment because I prove the comments. So thank you for thank you for your comments. So I do read every single comment. I can't respond to them all. Um, so, uh, but anyway, somebody had wrote a couple days ago what deck this was. This is my deck. This is a deck that I created. It's called Empress Oracle and you can find the link in the uh, description box below if you want to purchase it. It's up to you. Um, anyhow, uh, this is for right around the 21st. Uh, keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. So let's just see. We're gonna be, Anyway, I decided to use one of these or two or you know how I always say one more card. So you, whatever. Anyhow, what do we have for around the 21st? Well, older man. We have an older man here. So we have an older man that is in the picture. Oh, apparently we're getting one more. Ooh, pay attention to your dreams. Pay attention to your dreams. So interesting. Very, very, very interesting. Um, we also have one more card on the bottom that I, I feel the need to uh, share. This is only lust. So I'm not sure if you're dealing with somebody that it's only lust. Um, maybe, you, maybe you have another option. I don't know. Uh, let's get one more card. Mm. Unexpected help is arriving. So there's some sort of unexpected help that is arriving. Has to do with an older man and your dreams. Okay, so that's pretty interesting. What do we have for a message today? Pay attention to your dreams. There's a wish being fulfilled with that. That's like a shooting star. So unexpected help is arriving. Something you've dreamed, you know, something about your dreams. Seven of Cups just fell out. I believe we had this yesterday. I think it was the first card out as well. Um, but this is a different deck. So this is options, choices, consequences. Um, somebody has a choice to make. And you need to pay attention to your choices. Because what you own, owns you. So choose very wisely. You know, I feel like there's obviously, a, there's multiple options here, and there's a need to, obviously we have somebody here that is thinking about it. They're thinking about, you know, all their options. There's some sort of stress by the looks of things. What should I do? What should I do? It looks like we have one option that is off by itself. If you noticed, uh, there's one option over here, okay? So I think that, and then we have the past down here, which is the Six of Cups. We have an opportunity for love that may be being ignored. Uh, you know, it's there, it's upright, it's, it's available, you know, but somebody may be focusing on the past or they're repeating some of their past mistakes. You know, make sure that you are choosing wisely based on your dreams. Do not repeat the past. And those cups are in water, so when they're, in, they're you know, it's, it's about, there's, there's emotion that is involved. Somebody may be in their emotions, they may be in their feelings, they may not be seeing very clearly. There's some sort of confusion here. Do not repeat the past. There's an option 
that is that is real that is grounded you know that is something that i mean it's on the ground this is when when something is on the ground it's, it's, it's solid make sure that you are not repeating the mistakes of the past The chariot reversed. Now the chariot reversed is something stopping, not arriving, uh, emotions all over the place, uh, not not coming. Uh, this is this is stuck. Delay. Lack of willpower. No movement. No success. There's some, there's, we have somebody here that is stuck. They're stuck. They are, maybe they're lacking discipline or willpower. Or they're, they have scattered emotions, you know. There's a need to master emotions here. Don't go backwards. Make sure you're going forwards. We have somebody here that is not in control. They're, they've lost some sort of control. They've lost their willpower or their... ability to control themselves in some way. They've lost control or they've given up or something like that. Six of Wands. Six of Wands in the future. Six of Wands is about progress. It is about victory. It is about recognition. It is success. So we have an individual here who is very noble, that is highly respected, that um, has earned their title. This is a hero. So the six of one, this is a hero. This is somebody that has overcome obstacles, that doesn't give up very easily. So we do have a winner here. This is an arrival of some sort. This, this person is being urged to uh, go someplace by the looks of things. We have, we have a, a strong, noble individual here that is done, not interested in fighting, not interested in playing games. This person is ready to relax, very relaxed. It's like, I'm, I don't want to play any games at all. This person is, is coming, okay? Or they're here. Five of Cups reversed underneath that. That is a new prospect beginning to realize. Stop crying over the past. Again, we have somebody here that has, you know, been, I don't know if they've been in a state of grief or they've been focusing on the past. Again, with that Five of Cups, they've been, they've been uh, grieving. But this is the end of grieving. It is because it's like focusing on another option beginning to realize that there's another option. It's a better option. But you have to stop crying over the spilled milk. You have to stop repeating the same mistakes. There could be some extreme regrets for not moving forward, for continuing to play games, for continuing to compete, for... for uh, Allowing yourself to be an illusion or whatever it is. There's, there's consequences here with the Seven of Cups. There's a need to be grounded. There's a need to take control. There's a need to find your discipline and your willpower and your mental strength to uh, move forward. Move forward, okay? Um, there's victory to be had, but you can't engage yourself with competition or players, okay? If, Country for the six of wands or five of wands. You don't you, you gotta decide that you're not going to engage and you're done. You're done, you're done. You know, and that will require you to master your emotions to do so. But anyway, the five of cups reversed is letting bygones be bygones. It is focusing on the future, realizing there's another prospect.
after focusing on something that has probably been heartbreaking. You know, it's it's really time to stop focusing on uh, what is lost. Okay, it's lost. It's it's not there. There's nothing there. It's gone. You can't. If it's gone, it's gone. It's gone. You need to hold your head up high. You have. To, it's time for you to stop engaging in that battle. Nine of Wands reversed. Nine of Wands. That is giving up. That is giving up. That is uh, facing challenges. We have somebody here that um, is not learning their lessons. They're not learning their lessons and therefore they're going to be experiencing more challenges. This is somebody who has done it over and over and over again. And I, and I, you know, I'm, I'm pointing at you. Okay. I'm pointing at you watching this. You know, I'm going to, I'm going to sit here and wait and I'm going to sit here and, and wait for, you know, I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to give up. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait for the person that broke me or that's hurting me to change. No. No. It's time to uh, set boundaries. I feel like we have somebody here that is repeating negative patterns. They're unwilling to compromise. They don't want to give up. There's a need to stop waiting, whatever that means. There's another option here. Can't you see it? Nine of Swords in reverse on the bottom. This is giving deep thought to a relationship, extremely stressed out. Somebody's gut may be telling them that they're dealing with somebody that doesn't have good intentions. Listen to your gut. This is extreme regrets. It is. It's very, it's like, oh my God, I can't believe it. And the Five of Cups is regrets as well. I can't believe that I fought for this. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You know, so it's, but you know, and this is emotions all over the place by going backwards. Anyhow, I do believe that we have somebody here that needs, that is in a state of despair, probably extreme despair. They, they need to give deep thought to whoever it is that they, are in, that they are waiting for to make a move towards them, but that isn't making moves, that isn't coming. The chariot reverse, that's no arrival, that's, that's not happening, that's not, nobody's making any moves. So we have the seven of cups, we have an individual that is, you know, really in a state of why is this happening uh, you know love this is I, I'm in love <laughs> seven of cups seven of cups I mean look at this this is like waiting for the past waiting for something to happen where there's another opportunity that is being missed there's a choice that needs to be made and it may be that you have to stop waiting there's another, there's a noble individual here that is all done playing games. It's time to focus on the future. There's an, there's an unexpected arrival. This is a hero. This is a savior, right? This is somebody that is experienced, that is highly respectable, that has, that has supporters. This person is not uh, the past. This person is somebody that will protect you. It's a protector. That's right around the corner, okay? But there's illusion with the Seven of Cups. There's illusion that is stopping somebody from moving forward. 
fantasy. Illusion, Seven of Cups, stopping, Chariot reversed, moving forward, Chariot reversed. And I will not give up. I refuse to compromise. This is, this is my illusion. It's my fantasy. The Three of Swords. Three of Swords is heartache. It's pain. It's suffering. It is hurt. We have somebody here that is hurting. They're in, they're in pain, okay? This is heartache, this is heartbreak, this is in pain. So we have somebody here that is in some sort of pain. But there's progress to be had, okay? There is, but it will require movement. Uh, the chariot reverse is emotions all over, over, all over the place. It could be uh, something coming to a stop. Somebody may be, uh, they're really thinking about another option. They need to choose, you know, what direction they want to go in. Five of Cups reverse. There's definitely another prospect here with the Five of Cups and the Seven of Cups, that Ace of Cups right there. There definitely is. But there's a, the, you're going to have to give something up with that Nine of Wands reverse. You've got to get, that is giving up. You've got you to give up your stance. You've got to stop waiting for somebody to change. We have one individual here that is, has a lot of pride. They're on, they're, they have a lot of pride with the Nine of Wands reverse. This is a, I have to prove. I have to prove that I didn't make a mistake. I have to prove that I can win, you know. I have to prove that my position, you know, that I made the right decision. That I'm not a loser. But there's definitely, look at that, we have a stone heart. Mmm. King of Cups reverse. So this is emotionally unavailable, emotionally withdrawn. We have somebody here that is not willing to open their heart. Must be they have a stone heart. Didn't I just shuffle? I don't, I'm pretty sure that I did. Three of Cups, or Three of Swords, stone heart, still on the bottom. We'll have to rewind that after and see if I'm pretty sure that I did. Anyhow, uh, maybe I didn't, but I think I did. But anyway, King of, King of Cups reversed is emotionally unavailable. This is somebody that is not opening their heart, you know, may not have good intentions, emotionally withdrawn, doesn't communicate, um, is unwilling, unwilling to let love in. So This is heartbreaking, whatever it is with the Three of Swords. That's heartbreak, it's pain, it's heart pain. There's something to do with the heart here. All done, all done fighting. I feel like there could be some sort of challenge with the Nine of Wands where somebody you know, decides that, because in the chariot, it can be an outburst in reverse. It can be an outburst, emotional outburst ahead. We may, and there definitely could be with the King of Cups reverse. There could be an emotional, there could be a fight with the Nine of Wands. There's, there, get prepared. So we may have somebody here that is uh, burned out, okay? They're burned out. They have a chip on their shoulder, they uh, have been repeating negative patterns, they are facing a lot of life challenges, and it's because they, they, they want to prove something with the Nine of Wands, okay? They, they want to prove point to, I don't know who maybe is the world, I don't know, somebody wants to prove something. Anyhow, the King of Cups reverse is emotionally unavailable, it's unable to master emotions, unable to follow the heart, Cold heart, hard heart. I got justice on the bottom now because I did shuffle, but I'm going back to that three of swords. You got somebody whose heart is hardened. 
Isn't there a song about that? I'll look that up after. Anyhow, um, justice. Justice is a card of decision. It is a card of integrity. It's a card of uh, making a decision, doing the right thing, uh, being honest. Somebody has to be honest with themselves. We may have a contract here where somebody has to uh, um, obviously make a decision as to what is the truth, accepting the truth, needing to accept the truth. Um, making a fair and just decision between two options because there's two sides to the scales. Somebody has to make a decision and a fair and just decision is going to be made. And the Seven of Cups is about a choice, a decision as well. So we have somebody here that is about to make a decision based on the truth, based on the facts. You need to you need to weigh you need to weigh the options, right? You need to you need to you need to step outside of your fantasy and your illusion for a minute and go with the facts, go with the truth, okay? If there's no movement with the chariot reversed, if there's no forward movement, okay, and there's no communication, if somebody's not really communicating, the king of cups reversed, okay, that is somebody who is emotionally withdrawn. Uh, they're not they're not opening up okay they're closed off emotionally we have somebody here that is unwilling to uh, open their heart they're blocking their heart but there's regrets here somebody is going to have regrets extreme regrets with the five of cups reversed next to that king of cups that is extreme regrets because there's somebody else coming in that's your unexpected help this person the but you 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 have to master your emotions and choose wisely do you want to continue to mope and cry and be alone and focus on you know something that isn't happening or do you want to that isn't happening or do you want to uh, be protected by somebody that is coming to protect you because we have a protector here you know they say rejection is God's protection and we have this in the Virgo reading but it looks like we have rejection here. This is definitely protection because this is a warrior. This is somebody that has just been through some sort of battle or they have in the past. Okay, this is somebody who has already fought. They've already played their games. They're done. They're done. So I do believe that we, we, have, a, we, have, a, we have a strong, noble individual here who is uh coming in this is the un this is a protector this is somebody that you know is protecting another person they're trying to but there's free will here and there's choice i mean you can choose to push this person away with your with your uh, barrier because of your past or because you are in fantasy land or you can let this person save you um the choice is definitely going to be yours but anyhow justice is a card of integrity. It's about uh, making a fair and just decision based on the facts, not your emotions. Good luck with that.